Will Trevor Lawrence be an interception machine in year one out there in Jacksonville? What's going on, everybody? Let's look at a Trevor Lawrence prop bet here that I found on Novada, okay? Interceptions, over 14 and a half, even money. Under 14 and a half, minus 130. Now, we know who Trevor Lawrence is, right? 90 touchdowns, 17 interceptions in three years out there in Clemson. First player picked in the draft, considered by many to be a generational talent. We shall see. OK, um, it's interesting because in the 80s and the 90s, if you threw 25 touchdowns with 15 interceptions, that was a great year right now. Not too much. Not 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 so good. Right. Last year, Drew Locke and Carson Wentz were the worst quarterbacks in the NFL throwing interceptions. In it, and they only threw 15. OK, so this number here, 14 and a half for a player. You know, I know it was in college. College is a completely different ballgame. But for a player who only threw 17 interceptions in college and seems to be coming in really mature and prepared to play, I think it's I think it's a little high. And I'm looking at the quarterbacks here in the last few years, man. They're coming in ready to go. Joe Burrow only played nine games last year, but he only threw five picks. If he would have played all 16 games and kept up that rate, he would have thrown, what, eight interceptions or so? Justin Herbert threw 10 interceptions in 15 games last year. Baker Mayfield in 2018, well, he had 14 interceptions. In, in 13 ball games, right? In 2019, Kyler Murray only had 12 picks in 16 games. So these players, they're protecting the ball. So I think Tre Trevor Lawrence comes in, and I think he does a decent job in year one. I'm looking at something like 24, 25 touchdowns and maybe 11, 12 interceptions in his first year. So I'm going with the under at minus 130. We shall see what happens for everything regarding the world of betting, you can go to oddshark.com. Bye-bye.